Ibula guys, welcome back another episode of uh, FM96 Whisper right here on the FM96 website, fm96.com.fg. Hey, remember you can listen live, eh? Yeah. Uh, he said they're just listening. <laughs> Go to the uh, website right now, click play. Yeah. Listen to uh, whoever's on there right now, yeah. live. But right now, the FM96 Breakfast uh, Whisper, I wanted to talk about uh, being in the friend zone. Eh? Because oh. uh, many of us find ourselves in this uh, situation. Most of the time, it's the guys that are uh, unfortunate to be in this situation. Yeah, eh? man, it's the, always the guys that get the uh, worst part of it. What leads to being in the friend zone? Though? Where, uh, okay. Uh, it's what leads to it is the uh, other person does not want to be in a more committed relationship with, them, with you, and but you still want to you know you, st- you can't lose their presence. You just want to enjoy them. You still want to have that attachment. Eh? You still mm. want to be with them when they went. Eh? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what usually happens. Yeah, then you get uh, put into the friend zone. The friend zone. Yeah. And that's not a good zone to be in. Eh? It's not. Uh, well, it, it's got its benefits. Okay. Yeah. And it's got its uh, it's got setbacks more, as well. Eh? Yeah, more of a setback. Let's talk about the benefits. So, if you have friend zone somebody, you can use that person and yeah, milk yeah, it for all it's worth. Yeah. Like, for example, he can a friend. He can buy my data. <laughs> Same time, you know, I've been uh, being the other person that has been friend zone. Of course, you don't want to uh, yeah. use them. Eh? Yeah. You don't want to stay by their side. Mm. So, of course, you're gonna, when they ask for daily data, you're going to give them one week data. Mm. Another one is a uh, friend. Best friend, I'm feeling hungry right now. What do you want to eat? Eh? Mm? They ask for fish and chips. You go and buy them one nice curry soup sweet. A curry man can get soup sweet. They can ask me now for noodles and biscuit. Eh? Best friend, don't worry. I buy you some McDonald's. <laughs> that man is your money for your which bus fare. Yeah. So basically, you'd sacrifice everything for your friend mm. who's put you in the friend zone mm. because you don't want to lose that attachment and when they ask for something you'll go for the extra mile because you're still trying to get into their good books mm. you're still trying to win them eh? still holding on to that hope eh? mm. boy guys if you're in the friend zone right now mm. i don't know man you're <laughs> wasting your money because mm. while you're being friend zone like this she's right. going talking to that other boy who's got your you know your she's going to to that the spot other that boy. you want eh? and she's going to I got my friend who's taking care of me. <laughs> I will message you tonight when I ask my friend to send me data. Don't worry, I'm gonna vibe you. My data about to expire, but my friend will send me data. Don't worry. So that's just some of the benefits of uh, you know having a friend. Friend, yeah. yeah. So the negative aspects of the friend zone, eh? <sighs> yeah, it's okay. it's it's just everything is just negative because at the end of the day you're standing on the side, you are the loser, <laughs> la who zahar, you um just uh, nothing, you are being used, you are used and abused, abused, you are the la who zahar again, <laughs> and you are draining yourself emotionally, energy. And your pocket as well. <laughs> and, uh, but here's the thing though, you can actually escalate from uh, being into a friend, friend zone, zone into something more. What's more? Uh, a brother zone. Oh no. A bro zone. Oh no. Right. Oh no. That, that's the type of thing you, you yeah. have nothing to do. You all hope, all hope is lost. Yeah. When you've gone from the friend zone to the brother zone. Oh, that's my brother. Uh, you're, oh, don't, are you asking me out? We're brothers. You're my brother. We can't. That can't yeah. happen. That's like yeah. you. Yeah. yeah. Stuff like that. Eh? The moment that happens, guys, Ooh. I tell you what. If you have her on social media, uh-huh. unfriend, block. Viber, block that number. Because you have no hope. It's media. like it's like Thanos has just snapped his finger, and you have vanished as well, out of thought, out of mind. The only thing that exists in the brother zone, just like the friend zone, mm-hmm. is your money. And your pocket, that's all. And you know, in your friends, eh, you get to put in more extreme situations. Mm, mm. And when, for example, if you know, some uh, a guy would upset her, she would say something like, you know what, I'm gonna bring my brother to come and pound on you. <laughs> <laughs> you being the brother. <laughs> I don't know, man. It's a very. Hey, wait, the car is starting. Shh. Shh. I can't think of yeah. <laughs> That guy is. No, uh, he's not in the friend zone. Anyways, as we were saying, if you're in this situation, I don't know, choose wisely, man. Make up your mind because at the end of the day, based on experience, <laughs> you're wasting your time. Energy, draining your pocket. If I said, 
another episode of the FM96 Breakfast Whisper.